What's going on guys? Today is Sunday, September 1st, 2024 and we have 61 days before we launch the All Dreams platform to amateur athletes worldwide. Um, yes, it is 12.18 p.m. I had a meeting earlier so I was in here earlier to take that meeting. Just a development team meeting. Uh, progress status meeting so nothing big but um nothing much going on today really uh, I'm going to handle something that I, I need to handle right after I finish this intro or whatever and then um, I'm gonna see if I can work out blaze if you watched the video before blaze is a young he's like 13 or 14 and uh him and his parents they're from they're they're like us they're american they're like me they're americans and uh blaze is from atlanta he plays basketball and uh, i want to help him get better so if possible if he's available today before they play I'm, i want to do some show him some things work him out a little bit and you know that's what this is all about man honestly since i was a kid i just loved to play you know I just love to play who would have known that you know playing games whether it be football or basketball in 2024 could get you 300 million dollars or 60 million dollars in a year you know for playing it's, it's insane it's insane and since I was a young person that's all I wanted to do was is, is play so it's so fitting that you know I get to build this company, you know, all dreams because it's playing. And in 2024, you know how how people are building a comp building companies, you know, to each his own. But one of the things that I have been really really gearing up towards is building a media company with a product okay so building media on all different facets whether it's long form documentary podcast um, short form TikTok type things but all storytelling around athletes and building this media company that has this product and this platform uh, called all dream sports where amateur athletes can capture store share their sports journey build a community and earn money but it starts with this media company you know that has this product right and that's the direction that i'm building my company off of uh without media you don't have a company nowadays you know people the ones that do social media the best are the ones that will have the longest life in business in the forthcoming future gone are the days where you're running commercials on uh cable networks and getting massive customers that way nowadays people want to know who's behind the company who's running the company what is the motive for that person running a company what ties that does the the founder have to that company and i think that's where we want that's where we are going to win massively because my ties to all dreams the why all of that is there the story is all there and eventually it's going to come full circle where media will have to start covering my story it's just going to happen they're not on to it yet and it's nothing that i'm even going to force the main objective is to build the best product that we can build, talk to as many customers as we can talk to, get feedback, and that's the main goal of what I'm doing right now in building this brick by brick by brick, step by step by step, right? But media, this, what I'm doing right now, showing this complete journey, that's so key in what we are building with all dreams documenting this whole thing real time like the le this last episode you know what I, the, the 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 episode that's for today you know what i you know what i'm uh, i did i just let the complete interview 
uh, customer discovery interview just play just play out right um, because these conversations and and I want to get and I, I want to get better I want to improve and that's what you know that's what it's, it's, it's all about is is continuing to look yourself in the mirror and, and improve and I'm one of those people I'm one of those people but yes building media you know building a media company that has a product right that's the direction you know i want to take all dreams and again i've said this before but traveling the world finding these athletes telling these stories you know giving them a platform to have their complete sports journey all of these things you know i want to be the best at right Instagram may be the best at what they do. Huddle is the best at what they do. GoFundMe is the best at what they do. But we're the best at what we're going to be doing, right? Dedicated for athletes. So that's what I have to say for today, man. Everybody, listen, by the time you see this, this will be Monday. So have a great week. Start the week off on fire. And man, let's continue to chase our dreams. And let's continue to, to shake shit up. You know what I'm saying? Like... This is what it's about, man. This is what it's about. One life, all dreams, baby. Let's do it. Um, where we are or anything like that. Did she, anything special? I would love to have, hear special news on Sunday. <laughs> I, I, so I have an Amazon representative, AWS representative, and he said that I should talk to, to, to the developers about... Um, how much the storage would actually be per per customer okay so basically you want uh, you want to be purchasing a server and you are thinking of how much uh, storage you need per on, yeah, uh, yeah per yeah per per customer so, yeah so if we're so if we're char so if we're charging a customer 74.99 and that package is for unlimited storage um mm -hmm. we need to actually know because what if somebody uploads three gigab you know, three terabytes of, of videos and then we're losing money on, on each customer, right? So uh, I would like to get that information as far as um, storage wise, what it looks like per, you know, like generally uh EC2 server with four G B RAM would do. Uh, because uh, we we need to actually analyze how much traffic we are expecting in the very beginning of the launch. Okay. You know, and then slowly and gradually you might have some marketing plans or more users will join. We can right. uh, then uh, ask the AWS team to extend the services or maybe take a larger server. But in the very beginning, an uh, easy to server with 4 GB RAM is sufficient enough. Okay. But still, I'll have a word with the developer so that, uh, you know, um, just to provide you a little detailed information. So, in this regard, then I can drop you an email also. Yeah, that's something that I'm pretty, that's, that's something that I'm pretty concerned about is I'm talking to people and I'm telling them, hey, you can, you can put your, your entire sports journey on here and everyone yeah. I talk to, they say, oh man, well, my kid has been playing since he was in second grade. So they're gonna to want to go back and and put all of those videos because we we are going to have the ability to categorize those videos, but then also put those into years. You know, like whatever if they started in two thousand and and uh, fifteen, they'll be able to go yeah. back and go grab those videos out of their uh, camera roll and put them and categorize them. So I just want to make sure that 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 price or is that price is sufficient or should we should we cap that at a certain amount of uh space sort of like um dropbox does right dropbox maybe yeah. gives you like for 9.99 they may give you something exactly you know some gigabytes or something like that um mm -hmm. so maybe we maybe we we think about capping that at a certain amount so it's not just complete unlimited or whatever but that's just a exactly. con that's just a conversation that I that that I have in my mind that we should you know we should definitely um, 
start thinking about right now because we are today 61 days out or something like that tomorrow is 60 days out so uh and um everybody that i've talked to so far has said that they have videos some people have, have customers said they have deleted videos because they have so many videos so they don't have a place to put them but that's been a problem for every single customer that i've talked to that they actually do need a place for their videos. So even if even if no one supports a dream, which I think will happen a lot, the storage is a is a is a a main attraction for people to capture their sports journey. So we need to you know kind of start having that in our thoughts.